Hey guys and welcome back to Miguel Detailing, Miguel Detailing channel. Today we are basically going to be discussing a brand new tool. And this tool is not new to the market, it's been out for a very long time. But the tool is very new to me. I have seen videos on YouTube, reviews on this tool for the longest. Um, the tool that I'm talking about is the Tornador. Um, I was fortunate enough to get one for free. The one I got obviously is was used, but nonetheless, it is, works amazing. Um, it blew my mind on how well this tool can function. Uh, now, before I get into the tool specifically, I want to let you know that you need an air compressor to be able to use this tool. The air compressor I have is a Husky 8 gallon. Um, it is a 150 psi 1.8 um, horsepower great i never run on the air never had a problem with it works great um well actually i did have a problem the first one i bought uh on depot had an open box one so i got that one and it was they just killed some money because of it because it was open box but they didn't work as well so i returned it and they gave me a brand new one which works good I have been using it for so long and so far so good zero complaints about it so let me show you the tool first and then we'll get to it here's the tool this particular model is the p6-9.2 bar um, it is stainless steel i believe all through um this right here it is not stainless steel and you can kind of tell because he has a little bit of rust I'm not sure if you can see it on um, the way the tool works right here um, when you blow air in uh, this little nozzle thing and the I mean well let me open it up so I can show you this thing right here spins in a way that it can a, it, it, it makes a a tornado this uh, vertex or whatever you want to call it, it basically makes a little tornado where it blows everything in and whatever it blows all the debris gets sucks into the comb here uh, whatever is not sucks in in here it basically gets blown out um it works very similar to an actual tornado which is probably where the name came from um here this valve you can open it and close it it's easier to just let air in or allow it to suck the APC water or whatever chemicals you have in here. I recommend using APC diluted which to whichever liking you want. I dilute mine 11 to 1 or 10 to 1 for interior, especially on this gun. Um, I tried it out in different amount of vehicles. I tried it out in different areas of the vehicle. I tried it in a very clean vehicle for well, like something like a maintenance. I tried it in on a disaster vehicle and I will say this tool comes in handy in all applications um, the best thing I recommend for you to use it is on a maintenance vehicle or a vehicle that is not super super dirty that's where I recommend using this tool why because it allows you or it prevents you from getting out the steamer or extractor because this can clean out the carpet just as well and all you have to do is vacuum the axis or the, the debris out later on um, where can you use this uh, like I said you can use the door panels you can use it on seats uh, corners the, or the edges you can use it almost on anything then you can get your hands up you can use this the best thing about this is that it doesn't use a, a lot of chemicals so it's basically just a lot of air with a little bit of chemical in it and it does wonderful you don't have to go through so many products i don't like why you will buy a steamer because the steamer will remove a lot of things without having to use product just water so this is an essential item um in my book now that i, I got used to it tried out so many things and now I know where to use it how to use it and and where and when to use it the 
before I continue though, let me let you guys know. Please like, comment, and share this video. Uh, don't forget to subscribe as well. It helps us out a lot, a lot. You have no idea whenever I see a brand new subscriber into my channel, it, it motivates me to make more videos for you guys. Um, new content that's coming up will be reviews like the one I'm doing right now. Um, will be um, how to's. Um, I got a lot of new contents coming up and you guys just have to stay tuned stay there with me and anything you guys comment in the comment section below trust me I read it and I follow your comments and I do my best to respond and also follow your advices so do that um, let's get into the video itself like you can see um, same process as always I'm not gonna have any after any after shots basically because this video was made particularly the first day I tried this corner door so I can see how well it works and what I can do with it um just like I previously said there's so many things you can do with it so I don't want to go out there and explain it too much because there's so many YouTube videos out there where they go into detail on every little aspect of this gun and honestly there's no need it's simply a tool that will speed the process of your cleaning it will is the best bang for your buck um, because you don't have to replace it as often this particular one the previous owner had it for two plus years and they just gave me this one um what else i can say about this here about this tool oh hairliners i know hairliners are a headache to clean uh, mostly because they're so thin and you can honestly any chemicals or anything you put on it can bring the hairline straight back down because it's, it's so thin and it's just glue but if you use this with the other attachment that you can buy if you it didn't come with the gun when you buy it I don't know if it does or it doesn't because I, like I said I got this one juice they have a tool that you can go on to detailclean.com and they have a tool where it has a little brush at the end and this brush basically allows you to agitate a little bit more while you passing the tool around that particular area um, I would definitely recommend it on maintenance vehicle um, I would recommend it as an agitator for your carpet when you're doing a disaster vehicle uh, it will allow you to bring more dirt out and be able to vacuum better so it's definitely step your 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 vacuuming skills up like it will allow you to do a lot of things with to that uh, what else i could say the fee isn't much that i can see here and explain that you probably have not seen on another youtube channel before the only thing i can say that you probably haven't heard before is how to actually use it and where to use it like you have to know where to I don't care what tools you have, you have to know where and when to use that tool so you can get the best out of that particular tool. Well, you can get the best out of this tool, I would recommend doing it on a maintenance vehicle or a vehicle that is not as dirty. If that vehicle if by yourself takes you two hours, this is going to take at least 30 minutes away from that two hours. So you might finish in an hour and 30 minutes um, this particular vehicle. Maintenance wise, make sure to clean this. I haven't cleaned mine yet. Make sure to clean it. Um, make sure to have it leveled in a place where it's not just hanging and this is hanging. What? Because, you know, if you can't tell, this one is already wiggly here. But you don't want that because it might break. Um, just take your care of it. So, in my particular um, case, I make sure I have it in a place where it's like this. So, the heavy part is. On the ground this this I can leave this hanging in there or if you have a quick disconnect attachment to your van um, garage or whatever you can just strip it and hang it in there and put this to the side that way it doesn't create any weight pulling this thing down and then you know this could happen other than that guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe share this video and I'm gonna let you guys finish watching the rest of the video and see how I use the gun. Um, I did not forget about you guys that do love extractions, but I made sure to record at least a little bit of the extraction for you guys so you guys can see.
I have a wonderful day or night depending on what time you're watching this video and you guys peace out